Hey guys, it's me, Phyllis, coming to you with another video. Happy Sunday, you guys. Today is Father's Day, and we went for an early dinner, and now I am at home getting ready to do my hair. Just as soon as I answer this call. Okay, so as I was saying before, we were rudely interrupted. Um... Today is Father's Day. We had an early dinner and so I am home um, getting ready to do my hair. But before we get started, before we get started, if you are new, welcome, welcome, welcome. So happy that you stopped by today. Before you leave, please do not forget to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to thumbs up this video. And thank you so much for stopping by. And if you're not new, you're an oldie but a goodie. Hey, welcome back. I'm so happy that you're here and I appreciate your continuous support. Mwah. So, you guys, my package finally came in from the do. Yes, I got this big old box of stuff here. And uh, I kind of wanted to go through this with you because we're using everything to do from the wash to the mask, to the styling products, all of that today. So, you know, I told y'all in the last two videos that I'm going, I'm all about to do. These products have been amazing on my hair and I cannot wait to try the mask and yeah, I just can't wait. So let's just get into everything. So some of this I've already had. Okay. Yeah. All right. So the first thing I'm going to show you is the Do Be Girl collection. This is Crazy Sexy Curl Supercharged Honey All-in-One Setting Foam. Now I won't be using this today, but I'm tell. Well, you know what? I may use this today because I've already used the Pop Lock and I've already used the gel for a styling product. So I may use this today. I don't know. We'll see. And then the next thing I have is the Ladies First. This is a Moisturizing Retention Shampoo. And that's what this one looks like here. And then I also have the B-Girl Collection Supersonic. And this is the Moisture Retention Kadish. This is good for pre-poo, leave-in, and rinse out. So I am definitely going to use this as a pre-poo. And I'm definitely going to use this as a leave-in. Excited about that. And then the next thing I have here is the Doobie Girl Collection Sweetest Thing. This is the Honey Moisture uh, Mask. And this is what I'm most excited about. So this is what this looks like here. This is a... What size jar is this? This is a huge jar. 16 full ounces. So I am really excited about that. And then, let's see. Did I have this already? I have the Dew Cream. This is Coconut Rose Water Vitamin E Avocado Minoy. And this is a twist and curl cream for curling and defining the perfect twist out. So I probably will most likely use this. I think I'm going to use this because I haven't used cream in the last two washes. I've used the glaze and the gel. So I'm going to try out the cream. So I'll probably use that today. And then this one is the co-wash, you guys. Oh my God, they have the Do One Love Co-Wash Detangle Cleanse and Condition in One Step. So it says super slip conditioning cleanser wash day in a jar. No poo, no pre-poo decondition. So wow. So it says what it do. Cleanses, conditioning one step, eliminate wash day tangles with amazing slip, rinse soft and shiny, no waxy buildup. What's good? It has silk uh animoid uh acids. Uh, amino acids, I'm sorry, amino acids, aloe, rosemary, anti-breakage formula for uh, ultimate length retention. And then do you apply a liberal amount to wet hair, massage from scalp to ends, rinse thoroughly, tip. 
can also be applied to dry hair as a pre-poo to aid in detangling for more intense uh, conditioning treatment process 15 minutes under a cap under a plastic cap or a hair steamer girl did this thing say steamer <laughs> who has a steamer I do who's been using a steamer for the last two or three months I have oh my god so even if it didn't say steamer I would definitely prepare this with my steamer so oh my god I'm excited I am so excited about this so yeah we're gonna co-wash and the last thing I have here is the edge control this is a swagu edge control gel and it says a uh, all day hold for edges waves and braids aloe vitamin it has aloe vitamin e applied directly to edges smooth and style so that's what this looks like here and did i show you this one let me show you this one this is the uh co-wash so that is everything you guys so it's one more item that i want to get out of this uh product and it's the b girls uh custard and they did send me a text stating that they had it in and i waited two days too long and when i went in to order it it was already sold out again so I'm going to definitely try to get that the next time they have it in stock. So, today what we're going to do is we are going to co-wash. I cannot wait to try this. We are going to co-wash. We are going to deep condition. Yes, and then we are going to use the twist and curl cream. Um, I'm just trying to see. Let's see. On the... The leave-in conditioner, it says three times dope. Pre-poo leave-in or rinse out. This triple thread conditioner instantly detangles and penetrates the cuticles to protect, smooth, and strengthen dry, stressed hair. What's good? It has cat cationic honey, aloe, vitamin B, C, and E, keratin, silk, amino acids. Do you wash, apply to wet hair as a pre poo detangler or as a post-wash post conditioner, leave in or rinse out stylish usable. So, I am going to co-wash, I am going to do my moisture mask, and I am going to do my leave in and the cream and maybe the gel as well. I have the gel back here from last time that I used it. So, yeah. That's what we're going to do today. So when y'all see me get my hair, look at her. When I come back, my hair will be washed, conditioned, and everything, and waiting for the styling products. So I will see you guys in a bit, okay? I just, oh, I can't wait to tell y'all everything about these products. So I will be back in a minute. Peace. All right, you guys. So let me show you what the co. Oh, that's the wrong one. Let me show you what the co wash looks like. It's a real pretty pink color, and y'all, this stuff smells like laffy taffy. <laughs> I love me some laffy taffy, and this is exactly what this smells like. It smells so good. So. This is really a, a thick, creamy type texture, um, which I really, really like. Um, it was easy to work in. I had a lot of gel in my hair, so I rinsed the gel out first before I even put the cold wash on. And so by the time I got the cold wash on my hair, it just melted into my hair. It felt so good. It's very, it's thick, but it's creamy. And... Um, yeah, so let me show you what my hair looks like. So this is what my hair looks like. It's very, my hair feels very soft. And just let me show you. It looks pretty clean, pretty clean. So, yeah, it's not really a lot that you can say about co-wash. I mean, it was, I didn't detangle with it. Um, simply because I normally don't do that when I shampoo my hair. Uh, I mean, when I, yeah, when I shampoo or condition. 
um, now a co-wash but if I can put conditioner on after I shampoo my hair then normally I would go in and kind of detangle and make sure everything is you know good with it but I didn't do that this time around so now we're going right into the deep conditioning mask and that's what I'm most excited about the co-wash was really good I mean it smells good and my hair looks really really good really good so I want to get into this moisture mask so the moisture mask says what it do restores the conditioning the condition of hair and scalp hydrating beyond the cuticles uh, layer to improve texture reduce friction uh, bring back elasticity and prevent breakage what's good it has cow cat cat cationic honey i think it is aloe vitamin b c and e carrington suc amino acids and then massaging to clean soaking wet hair and scalp so maybe i should have did this when i shampooed my hair but i have water some oh i have some water here um it says that you detangle and process for 15 to 30 minutes for a more intense treatment process under a plastic cap or hair steamer and rinse thoroughly so yes that is what we're going to do and this is what it looks like it's a white texture um, it's thick it's not going anywhere y'all know I love that y'all know I love that this smells like really nothing it's it's a light smell very light smell okay so y'all let's get into this this is what i'm most excited about so i'm gonna go ahead and um just kind of comb out my hair a little bit and then i'm gonna soak it with water i guess i need a towel or something Soak my hair. Okay. And then we're gonna oh child, yes, that's thick. That's very, very thick. Okay. Oh. Yes, oh my God, it feels really, really good. Let me get these ends because I've been having some issues with my ends. I don't know if they need to be trimmed again or what, but my ends have been really frizzy. So we're going to use this detangling bur bur uh, comb. This time, you guys, I don't think I'm going to use the oil. You, you know I normally pair a mask with the oil. But this time, I'm just going to do the mask uh, just to kind of see, you know, um, how well the mask will work with the steamer. So I am not going to do my oils today. All right. So probably right here, I'm just going to speed up. Again, I'm going to soak my hair um, like the direction says. And um, put this deep conditioner on. 
and keep it pushing. Okay, you guys so I am done with the deep conditioner it had good slip to it um, especially at the roots so this is how much I use I use quite quite a bit I was very liberal with it so yes I did I liked it I, I liked it I like it so far so I can't wait to see what my curls and everything looks like after I do the steam bath so steam bath after I do the steam cap thingy <laughs> steam bath oh my god I did have a drink earlier so that could be it but anyway so I'm, I am going to sit up under the up under my steam cap for about 30 minutes I was going to say 20 but I think I'm going to do 30 and then I'll come back I'll rinse that out and then come back and let you see what my hair looks like and then we'll get straight on into the uh styling products so i'm excited i mean i'm excited about using everything everything so i will see you guys in a minute peace okay so i just rinsed out the honey supercharged honey moisture mask so let's see what my hair looks like okay What do y'all think? My curls look good. I really want to cut this, y'all. I think I had mentioned that in the last video. <laughs> I want to cut that. My hair feels really soft. Really soft. Feels good. It feels good. Now, I will say I've had uh, some deep conditioners that work, that did a little bit more for me in my hair, but you know, I'm good with it. I use the steam cap with it. And let me look in the mirror. Because sometimes you can see more in the mirror than you can in that viewfinder. But my curls are looking good. And my hair do feel soft. So, yeah. I, I, yeah. I definitely will use it again. Yeah. That looks... That looks good. What y'all think? Look at that. Hair feels good. Okay, you guys. So, like I said, I want to use as many products as I possibly can today. So, I am definitely going to use the Twist and Curl Cream. I'm definitely going to use that today. Let's just show you what this looks like. And it looks like I think I've already used this. And I don't remember. I guess I did already use this. Huh. So I'm wondering if I should use the because uh, I've already used this. Maybe I can use the uh, setting foam. Hold on for a second. Uh, twist out. This is defines and sets washing goes and fast drying with a flexible hold and no frizz or flaking. For best re results, do not apply oil to hair before applying this product. 
apply a liberal amount to clean damp ha damp hair in small sections and smoothing from root to end air dry hood dry or diffuse allow hair to dry 100% before spreading uh, separating curls hmm let me see what the leave-in conditioner says. The leave it, the conditioner says triple threat detangle cuticles part of uh, apply to with hair as pre poo detangle or as post wash contangler detang conditioner leave in or rinse out style as usual. Okay, so I think I'm gonna use the leave in conditioner with this because I think the heaviness of the conditioner will help um with this being a water base i mean it's watery so i'm afraid to just use this by my by itself on my hair as a styling product because i feel like my hair is not gonna last long so i'm gonna mix it with the leave-in conditioner and i may use a little gel too so i may mix it with this big papa defining gel so I'm going to do my leave-in, my styling product, and then, well, my leave-in, and instead of using the cream, I'm going to use the, um, the, the uh, style setting foam, and then I'm going to kind of put a little um, gel on it to hold, for hold. So, all right, so let's get started, you guys. Let's just get started with this. For Juneteenth, I never really do anything, but they're really doing stuff this year with because this is the first year that it's been recognized as a federal holiday. So people are really getting out there and celebrating and all of that, you know. So yeah, I don't think I'm doing anything though. Okay, so we're gonna do the leave-in. Let me see what this looks like. Oh. So the top goes like this. And you see how that looks. I'm going to put just a little bit. I'm not going to put a whole lot. Let's see. I don't think I need a little bit more. So I'll put that much on. Okay, and this time I think what I'm going to do with my ends you know, is um, use my dimming brush. Maybe that'll help it out some just on my ends here. i use my dimming brush. Okay, so now we're going to go into the foam. And I guess we don't have to shake it or anything. So I'm just going to take this off and get going. So that's how much I'm going to use. Oh my God. That smells like something old school. Oh my goodness, I can't remember what it is. Okay, so look at these curls, you guys. So we're going to go ahead. I'm going to put just a little bit of gel because uh, just a little bit. I don't want any flaking, which I probably won't get any flaking with it. But I'm gonna, since I'm mixing it with the uh, mousse, We'll see. I won't put a lot on. Just enough to kind of hold it. So, yeah. Uh, look at that. Look at that. That looks very nice. Very nice. Okay. So, we're going to start off 
with the, the leave-in. tell you what that uh, foam, um, that setting foam smell like in just a minute. It's something that, it smells like honey. That's what it smells like. Oh my God, it smells like honey. That's exactly what it smells like. Let me get up here. Get these roots up here. Okay. Yeah, it smells like honey. Okay. All right, you guys. So I'm going to finish up and then I'll come back once I'm done. Okay, so we are done applying all of the styling products. I cannot wait to see what my hair is going to look like. I cannot wait. But unfortunately, we won't see that until tomorrow. So, I've used every product. The last one, I think I'm going... The only thing I didn't use today was the shampoo. I didn't use the shampoo today. But, I mean, I used the leave-in. I used the mousse. Ew. Oh, and I didn't use the cream. Ew. Yeah. Oh. I said ew. But, yeah, I didn't use the cream. So, I didn't use the cream or the shampoo, but I did use the moisture mask and I used the wash and go. I used the leave-in and I used the styling foam and yeah, and the gel. I did use the gel. And then um, this right here, I'm going to use this tomorrow. Oh, this smells, oh my God, what does this smell like? This smells like, I don't even know. But it smells good. So I'm hoping. I, I haven't been really liking the edge control thingy that, that I've been using. So I'm hoping that I'll like this. So yeah, you guys. That is it. So I will see y'all tomorrow on Juneteenth. What y'all doing on Juneteenth? Y'all put it down. Or tell me and put it down in the comment box which y'all did for Juneteenth. Maybe that'll give me some ideas for next year for Juneteenth. And hopefully it won't come around Father's Day because that's a lot. That's a lot. Father's Day and Juneteenth. Ugh. Girl. Okay. So anyway, I will see you guys tomorrow. Peace. Hey, you guys. So this is the next day. And this is what my um, hair is looking like. I can say... Um, my curls are nice. Um, I can say that my hair is very soft. It has a lot of body. Look at that. It has all that nice body to it. And because I have so much body to it, I think that my hair, my curls are not going to last long. Probably three to four days, maybe three days at the most. Um, yeah. So my battery is going dead. I wanted to go ahead and use this. Uh, swag goo on my hair. I wanted to use it in front of y'all. Let me see. I'm going to turn this way. This stuff smells so good. Happy Juneteenth, y'all. Happy Juneteenth. Me and my husband, look, we getting ready to getting ready to go out and get some lunch. So, yeah. Okay, can y'all see that? I think I need to pull y'all back some. Hold on. Okay. I'm just trying to hurry up because my battery is about to go dead. And I have this brush here, but I normally don't use this brush. Because, for one, I don't know... I, I don't think I really need it. I just use my fingers to do what I need to do and keep it pushing. 
but this is how this is doing on my edges swag goo so y'all can, can y'all see my edges so that's what that is looking like right now i love the way it smells yeah so you guys i'm loving my hair um i really like the dudes products i like them all um yeah, and my you can tell the definition of my curls. I mean, I just yes, I love it. I really do. I love it. It's just really, really nice. All right, you guys. So that's the end of this video. Put down in the comment box what you think. All the products. Think about all the products that I used today. If you have any, uh, or yesterday, if you have any questions, please put it down in the comment box. Please subscribe. Please hit that like button because that's only going to help your girl out. Please hit that like button. And also, do not forget to hit the notification bell so you'll be notified every time I upload a video. Remember, you are blessed. Be well and be you. And I will see you in the next video. Mwah. Bye.